Much of an accused child molester be in jail until he goes on trial. One family believes so, but it didn't get their way today. William Casey walked out of court a free man, and now a child victim's family members say they're growing impatient, waiting for justice to be served. Here's First News senior reporter Jerry Ricciuti. William Casey apparently didn't want to be seen as he left the Mercer County Courthouse this morning, using his jacket to hide his face. He appeared for a status hearing on child sex charges from an arrest nearly two years ago. I'm going to fight for my niece, but I'm going to fight for all the victims because there's there's many victims. Casey is from Girard, although he's accused of assaulting a young girl on two occasions in late 2014 and the spring of 2015 at a home in South Pymatuning Township. He's facing trial for aggravated indecent assault on a victim under the age of 13. Although court records show he spent time in prison on similar child sex charges a dozen years ago and he missed a scheduled hearing date last month, a judge lowered his bond from $100,000 to just $20,000 and he was released. That's the frustrating part that right now he's free again and there's victims more than likely probably out there. The alleged victim's father tells me while the case seems to be dragging on, the family isn't able to get any closure. Wake up every morning with my daughter asking me questions and did you see that white van? Is, is he in jail? Very, very disgusting. For now, Casey remains free pending another hearing Monday afternoon where lawyers will discuss whether they can work out a plea deal or if the case will have to go to trial later this month. Family members say they will continue to follow it until it's resolved. This is a personal issue to me, but I fought hard for almost two years. In Mercer, Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News.